it was getting cold, it was windy, it was starting to sprinkle a little bit. And with my mom's age, there's no way she can stay outside for that long. A major letdown for some San Diegans 75 and up expecting to get vaccinated against COVID-19 today. Long wait lines for some to give up and go home empty handed. ABC 10 News reporter Anthony Pura has more on what's contributing to these long wait times. Christy Young says her 83 year old mother was supposed to get vaccinated against COVID-19 Tuesday. We had an appointment for 218 and we were really excited that we can get in. Her appointment was at the Escondido site on Mission Avenue. This was how the line looked a little after 4 p.m. Tuesday. The line Christy described when they went there was much longer. They were told it would be about a two hour wait. It was getting cold, it was windy, it was starting to sprinkle a little bit. And with my mom's age, there's no way she can stay outside for that long. So um, we decided just not to take the, not to take the chance of her getting sick or catching something out there. So I just, I just brought her home and decided it's safer at home. Erica Fung and her grandmother had a similar experience. Erica took her grandma to her appointment at the vaccination super center near Petco Park in downtown San Diego. She's going to be 89 in March. She has emphysema and she is a cancer survivor. She had breast cancer. And so for her, getting vaccinated really was crucially important. This is video from Monday of cars trying to get to the vaccination super center. On Tuesday, Erica says she and her grandma waited in traffic for about two hours without any significant movement that they called it quits. It really makes me frustrated and pretty angry that we can plan things like the rock and roll marathon, you know, the heart walk, other key events where you have thousands of thousands of people and traffic is, is planned and it's got to flow and people get where they need to go. But then something like this, there's, there's not even a chance for people to get in. A county spokesperson says there was a computer glitch at the Escondido location that allowed double booking of appointment times contributing to the longer wait times. Instead of turning them away, the county honored the appointments. An appointment is needed to get vaccinated, and according to the county, there are people showing up thinking they don't need one. That's also increasing wait times. Both Erica and Christy say they're going to try again to get their loved ones vaccinated in the coming days. We're just trying to be as patient as we can with everything. Anthony Pura, ABC 10 News.